What's going on guys, not far from game here, and we are back once again playing some more Clash Royale. And today guys, I want to show you the best Elite Barbarian deck. Now, before we show you that deck, I just want to give a sh quick shout out to this uh, very awesome member in the clan. Um, man, his name is Majid, um, but look at that. He's already got a thousand, he's killing it. We only need one more tier and we get to, uh, to tier 10. So I'll go ahead and show you guys the deck now. I just wanted to give him a quick little shout out. So there's lots of decks that are floating around that are similar to this, but... A lot of them have archers instead of skeleton army. I prefer skeleton army. So let's just go ahead and get right into it. Let's go ahead and jump into the first replay. I actually have a three crown right here and a three crown right there, but I'm gonna go ahead and watch this one just because it's a closer match and it shows you, um, you know, more of how to play it. And basically, if someone drops like a giant or a lava hound or a golem on one side, and you luckily have the elite barbarians and hog rider up at the same time. Just drop them as fast as you can on the other side, and it's an instant tower. Maybe even a three crown. Um, so right here, uh, this is what I'm talking about. He does fireball it, um, and he misses. And I was like, okay, rip this tower. It's going pretty much all the way down. Um, actually, I do think I take it out. Maybe, yeah, we do take it out. Sweet. So that right there, that was just the first push. And just like that, we already have a one crown advantage. Now we could go for the three crown, could go for the two crown, or we could just defend, which... Um, it's kind of tough, but you guys will just have to see. So, I figured out that the Ice Golem is actually really good for de defending the Minion Horde. Um, just because it's little splash damage it does when it dies. Um, and then the tower just has to clean all the archers, or the minions up. So I'm going to go ahead and Fireball right there, thank you very much. And I knew he was going to put the Wizard or something in the middle of that, so I was like, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and drop my Ice Golem off to the side. Drop my Mega Minion as close as I could. Um, or actually, this is when I, uh, this is right here, the perfect example. We're going to go ahead and use the tornado and take all that out, and yeah, the um, wizard gets one shot off, but look at this counter push. It all goes to waste, though, with that log, um, but we do get a little bit of damage. He fireballs right here, misses my mega minion, and guess what? Boop. Thank you very much. We're going to get 300 damage off. Also, guys, this is really random, but I just remembered, and I had to tell you guys, this is probably going to be the last video on this laptop. Um, and then I'll be able to record on all my other videos on my new computer very well. And look how well I played this. Uh, look, at he, the Hog Rider does not get a single hit. Nothing gets a hit. Gave him the thumbs up. I do it twice to him. So we're going to try to get a little bit of a push right here. But he does have the Minion Horde, which I did forget about. Um, I tried to place the Ice Golem up, and it didn't work. I do Fireball, but not in time. Getting that tower down to 1,700 exact. Wow. Don't see that every day. So look at this, we're going to drop the Mega Minion, we're going to go Log, Skeleton Army, and then we're going to Tornado it back. Look at this, doesn't even get a hit again. He's going to go ahead and Fireball, and there's literally nothing he can do, guys. This is going to be an easy one crown win. Look at that Prediction Fireball, that was perfect. So here he is coming in one more time, he's going to try to set everything down, I'm just going to put the Log. Um, elite barbarians this time and there is nothing he can do he does get a hit off I just kidding he doesn't put the <laughs> I put the tornado down because I thought um, it would spawn up quick enough but we didn't need it so we're gonna go ahead and jump into a live match so hopefully fast. everything turns out and what oh my gosh yes alright so we started out with the two that I wanted so hopefully he drops a lava hound golem or giant or something that costs a lot of elixir in the back so I can just go to town on his tower okay so he's got that that really can't do anything let's just go ahead and fireball it screw it boom there we go, take that out. He's probably got the Lava Hound, um, I'm guessing. Okay, Mega Minion, then he's going to put the Lava Hound in front of it. You know what we do to that? We go like this, so that he can't do it. And if he does it, then I... it's a, Yep, that's okay. It's a tower for a tower, except my tower is going to get a 3 crown. So, hopefully we can get ready. Hopefully, he's probably got the Skeleton Army. Nope, okay, we're going all. We're going all for it. Let's just log the tower and miss literally everything I could have hit right there. And, um... Yeah, this is this might be really bad for us actually. Yeah, I don't know if this is gonna be good. Let's go like this. He's probably got the log, I'm guessing. Nope. Okay. So we are winning this battle right now. I would say. Um, okay. Not good. Can we tornado this? Okay. Well, it's about tied now. He's gonna drop a, a golem in our deck or in our base, and it's gonna be so bad. Um, so we gotta get ready. Hopefully we can get up enough elixir to take everything out because there's no way we can stop a golem deck this close to uh, my tower going down. So hopefully we can spawn everything up. 
Okay, here's our chance right here. And boom, boom. He's probably going to put that uh, annoying um, skeleton. Yep, there it is. Okay. And the Mega Minion or Ice Golem. Okay. Uh, let's log. Oh, I think we can do it, guys. Come on, stop chasing that. Stop chasing that stupid thing. And this is going to be a three crown already. Oh my gosh, look at that. Good game. That is just how good this deck is. So we're going to add three crowns to our clan chest right there. And we are so close to getting that. I'll probably be making a video of me opening this chest um, in the near future. But let's go ahead and open this free chest before we end off the video. And we got nothing good. Oh, we got those. Almost level 10. Sweet. But anyways, guys, if you are new, definitely subscribe. Hit the like button. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Hold up.